Favreau. I'm, I'm John Favreau. Yeah. John Favreau. I'm Cardoon. Look at me, I'm Cardoon. I'm a god. I'm Cardoon. <laughs> That pizza has been there since Saturday. Somebody ordered a slice of pizza and something and never bothered to come down and pick it up or it was delivered to the wrong address. Either way, it's Monday and it's time to start the Daily Vlog Weekly Show. That's right, it's Monday, I'm back. Uh, this is the start of week four of uh, the Daily Vlog, I guess. <laughs> Uh, it's gone by pretty fast the last three weeks. I just posted the first one up tonight. We are podcasting tonight. Uh, so, you'll be introduced to the podcast this week. You can find it at lowblowpodcast.net or all your favorite podcasting apps of choice. Give me a little sneak peek into there. The one other thing I do creatively. And then, I gotta build a lamp for my cousin uh, and her baby and her husband, Tony. I also build lamps for the DIY things. And that's really gonna be the most exciting part of my week. Um, and then hopefully by the end of the week, I can get my microphone fixed uh, or a new stand for it. So I can go back to vlogging on the Sony. As much as I love the iPhone. Well, it's an iPhone 7. It's not even a nice one. So. Hey, it was Monday. It's snowy and, well, you know, life. Hey, look, squirrel. I've really only seen this man for about... Bread. You gave me bread. bread. That was it. For, for a two-minute bread break. Yes. Which is because I got an extra sourdough roll and... It smells like pizza in my neighborhood. It's weird. Not like a good pizza either, it's like a weird B.O. pizza. Ever since I was a little kid, I've always felt like a spaceman in big, heavy winter gloves. I don't know why, just something that always kind of made me giggle, I guess. Good morning, vlog. What is up? It's Wednesday. Uh, yesterday was a pretty busy photo editing day. I've been working on the same photos for a few days now and it just doesn't feel like they're really going anywhere. But they are getting done. So, but it actually snowed. I didn't think it was going to snow this year. I mean, not accumulative, but I guess it is January. So, I got to dig out my car, all that fun stuff. Yeah, it's cold, but it's Wednesday. Uh, I do have a DIY lamp project I plan on building uh, probably Friday. All the parts should be here in the next day or two. So I'll take you on that journey. I build lamps in my spare time for friends and family. They're very cool. So I'll do that. So if you're watching, you're like, eh, not really going into. You got something to look forward to the next day. Tomorrow I'm going to go to Home Depot and buy the parts, and I'll show you what I do there too. So, you know. Busy Wednesday, busy Thursday, busy Friday, relaxful Saturday. I gotta go dig out my car. So I'm doing this in one six scale. So all the crib pieces are uh, very tiny. Today is already going to be one of those days where I lose my mind. It's Thursday, and I've, 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 yeah, yeah, it's, it's one of those days for sure. Um, I have this hook that I put on one of my walls for my coats when I enter my apartment. That one right there. And something I never, ever, ever, ever do is put my keys on it. Well, apparently when I came in last night, I did that. And when I went to leave work about... 
25, 30 minutes ago, I couldn't find my keys. I tore my entire apartment, panicked, freaked out. Ah! And for 30 minutes, they're staring me right in the face on the hook. It's cold. It is 16 degrees Friday morning. And I have so much to do today. So yesterday, the key incident, which drove me nuts, destroyed my apartment. I ripped it up, it's, got, it's just all over the place. So I have to go home and clean that, fine. But I also have to do the lamp. But I got all the stuff last night for the lamp. Um, and I got one more piece of stuff coming today. Uh, so I got one more thing coming today. God, it's too cold for this shit. Um, but yeah, so I'll, I'll show you guys how I build those tonight. It'll be fun. I got to find some more parts tonight. It's going to be a late night and early morning, but it's going to be a good day. I want to get in my car because it's really cold. Okay, bye. So what I'm going to do, you can't, that's a cat. It's all right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to scrape the sticker. Um off of this old candle. Have some goo gone. Let me scrape it off. Because I'm gonna use that as the lampshade. I was actually gonna use a real lampshade, but um, it doesn't fit on the bulb the way I want it, so that is out for now. Um, bring the iPhone over here. I got a two camera setup, so I can still use my mic. And I'm just gonna goo gone this label, and it will get attached to my light source. I'm looking for that, I don't know where that is right now. But the l actual lamp that I repurposed but I also don't want to scrape the frosting off of the candle. Um, so kids, hold on to your candles um, because they can be used as life. This is going in a baby's room, so we have a 25 watt soft LED and then this will just sit on its candle base, wherever that is. I have to cut a hole into that and it'll mount to a, well, basically a cast iron stand. And then it'll just bloop, sit right there. Well, day. Day. All right. So, where I get my lamp parts from, a lot of the times, I buy them um, new, but every so often, I will go to the thrift store, and I will buy an old lamp. Why? Because it's one less thing I have to worry about building and fixing and all that other stuff if the lamp is already done and I can keep some of the parts for myself. That is really tiny. Um, so then I can keep extra bits for myself because those are important. Um, so this is the lamp we're gonna take apart. And that is that. Uh, here we go. So small rig uh, makes this little multi-tool usually for a camera, but in a pinch where you don't want to get up, it's also good for your unscrewing of lamps. So, am I a licensed electrician? No, but I did work for a lighting company and they did teach me how to build all this stuff. And generally, I can buy the parts if I really, really wanted to, um, which is fine, but if I can find something that's already built, I don't have to worry about rebuilding everything from scratch and I can just 
take it apart and have the lamp stuff where I need it. And that's generally how I like to do it. It's just easier that way. I should have really thought to see if this came off. Um, it should come off. I hope it comes off. Um, that would be not great if it doesn't come off. I mean, I have oodles of this stuff all over the place, but I always like to start kind of fresh. Um, with whatever it is I'm doing. This is interesting. I've never seen this kind of socket before. That might be a problem. Where am I at? That is a good question you could ask. Basically, I've taken my butcher block and I've mounted a hole. I've drilled it. That's all I've done. I've given up on trying to cut out this circle. I just... I don't have the two idea how to do that. So I have to find another way to get this glass to mount to this shade because I do want to go that way. So we'll see what I can do there. So far, I'm unsure. But, so what I'm gonna do is I'm actually going to take the wire that I have, and I've spent a couple minutes stripping them, um, and I'm going to feed it through and actually mount the thing. So I can actually make progress and get back to working on the miniature that I need to build. So that's where I'm at. Once the wire's all through and I can mount feet, I gotta make some feet. I think that'll be fine. But the feet are gonna be easy. So I have little tiny wood screws and these old rubber nubs and some Gorilla Glue. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drill the feet into the bottom and I'm going to Gorilla Glue the little nubs on there. Just essentially a nightmare and I'm trying to figure out how what is the best way to get the lamp inside where I want it I think putting this guy down in there like so might be good but we got to do something about this because I don't like that it moves I wanted to put it in here, but this is not the right size. 
And it's throwing me off because I thought it was. And it's just, it's just a little too. It's just, it's a, it's basically the size I need it to be. But it's just a little. I just can't. I should get it in there. Yeah. Basically, this nipple, that's what it's called, a nipple, and uh, this nipple are supposed to talk to each other, but whoever made this can't really see it. This side is deeper by just the tiniest tiniest little bit and I don't think I have any way to um, I think it's just gonna be too I don't think I can get it out I'm gonna try to dremel it out real quick and see what happens just too big for it to work so I have to come up with a slightly different design I think I actually, digging around in my parts bits, found a solution. A, a, a real solution. Which should be nice and cool to my problem. Because once I figure out this, then I can figure out the lampshade. Once I get the lamp working, turning on and off, I don't really generally have to worry about... Oh my god, yes! Holy shit! Okay! Um, I have this uh, nice twine right over here that I'm gonna glue and run back up over here so it looks like the microphone has a, uh, you know, a cable. So that's kind of the idea of where we're going. We gotta finish building this. I have a bunch of balsa of wood I need to cut. So until then, uh, I'm gonna cut that and uh, first I'm gonna clean this place up, but you guys don't need to see that. All right. Oof. It's gonna be a long morning. Um, it's also going to be like a seven cup of coffee cup of type of day. I'm on four and a half hours of sleep. It took me a while to get that crib finished where it's finished. I have to go and I have to get a lamp shade. And then I have to go grocery shopping and then I have to do a bunch of laundry. So, that's my morning. We're going to go and do that. And then hopefully the reveal will be cool. And they'll like it because if they hate it, then I give up. I'm still debating if this is going to be a two part video where I keep the vloggy part short but the project long. I don't know. I might just sprinkle it in. I want to keep these under 10 minutes. So that's where I'm at today. That's what we're doing. Yeah. So it's done. It's completely 100%. It's Saturday morning. I ran and I did all of my stuff. Uh, it's all done. It, it, it looks exactly the way I wanted it to come out. Um, scale's probably not perfect, but I don't care. It looks like it works. And that's all that really matters. So have a look. Today was a long day. Um, I did some product photography for uh, my girlfriend's company, fun time. And then that was Sunday. That was pretty much all Sunday. Uh, it was a long week, but hey, it was a lot of fun. And I'm gonna break this down um, at the vlog. It's really my Sunday. Unfortunately, I, I couldn't show anybody anything because you know NDAs. I'm gonna look at 
stuff, new products, but uh, it was good. It was a good time. So yeah, I'll see you guys.